Yo, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to J3 Entertainment. We got some fire for y'all today. Oh, yeah. But before we get into that, I want y'all to know who I am. I am J3. I'm Ronan Shogun, Ninja Assassin. Wah! What's up? What up, bro? Man, it's reaction time. This is something we've been trying to do for a minute. Oh, yeah. Like, like almost like two years. Pretty much, yeah, it's been, it's been a minute. And yeah. I was like, yo, the audience recommended it, and I was like, dang, you know, Ronan, let's just do it. Of course. Just do it. Let's get into it now. Hurry. If you saw the thumbnail, we about to react to Wayne. This was a YouTube exclusive. Yeah. Which is now, I think, on Amazon Prime. Yes. Shout out to Amazon. I heard this show was fire. What you hear about it? I heard the same thing. Well, uh, with that being said, uh, I'm a fan of the cast too. Let's, these actors. let's get into episode one of Wayne. Get some then in 4K. Let's get it. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I love this show. <laughs> I like that right there. What? Screw up, you fucking freak. Damn. I said go. Here. What the fuck? You asshole. <laughs> hey! Who did that, huh? Who the fuck did that? You? Break my window, you bitch? Break my window? Huh? Why don't you answer me, you little bitch? Answer me! Damn. Wow. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah! Interesting. <laughs> he beat the bike up. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Boy, I fucking kill you. Stomping this bike out. <laughs> <laughs> he got heart. Man, what the fuck? <laughs> he tired, bro. Yeah. What's the motive? Sad, bro. Wayne. Chapter one. What? 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 Trying to sell you some goddamn cookies is what? <laughs> Sorry, my, my dad's sleeping. Snickerdoodles. Well, why the hell didn't you just say that then? Shoot. And you, why is your dad sleeping in the middle of the day anyway? He lazy? No, he's got cancer. Damn. Well, can people with cancer still eat cookies or whatever? He ain't been eating much lately. This axe is you? savage, man. You like cookies yeah. or are you as weird as you look? I like cookies. Great. We got a uh, peanut butter kind. Coconut kind, which tastes like dog shit, in my opinion. Some people like them. And uh, there's lemon. Them lemons was so. fire, bro. McDonald's. Heck yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, you want to come in? You ain't going to do anything weird, right? Weird like what? Like some guy down on tour, he asked if he could see my feet. I don't want to see your feet. <laughs> I like this. Yeah, whatever. It's fine, I guess. You like music? Yeah, most. I mean, I like rap. Fuck <laughs> rap, baby. Right, 
<laughs> oh, I know. There's a fish. <laughs> like, you're fresh out of water, bro. So, uh, you got a boyfriend? Not really. You want me to be a boyfriend? I don't want anything to do with my bitch ass family anyway. I do everything I can to make sure nobody even knows I'm one of them. I don't know. What's your family? Do you need people to remind you who you are? Where you're from? Whatever. Whoa! God Daddy! damn. Daddy! Hey, back off. Uh, 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 uh. Whoa. What do we got here, huh? Who the fuck are you? Who are you? Who the fuck are you? <laughs> and why were his hands all over you, huh? Why, Daddy? Cut, get, cut. get away from me. I asked you a question, you pervert. Hmm? Fucking pervert. Piece of crap, fucking pervert. Just let him uh, up. Back off! Hey, look at me. Hey, you're, you're quite sick. Come on, drink. Oh, you a tough guy. You're so pretty. I'm gonna ask you one time. One fucking time. What the fuck are you doing alone with my 15-year-old daughter? Find some cookies. Wayne, don't. I thought I fucking told you, Dell. Huh? I'm sorry. Stop stealing and selling fucking cookies. <laughs> God damn it. Give it to me now. It's mine. You best watch your fucking mouth and give me that money, you little thief. I am not playing. You think he's playing? He ain't fucking playing. Shut the fuck up, fucking shit for brains. Fucking shit for brains. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's <he's> not. <laughs> give me the fucking money. Raising a goddamn thief. Useless like your fucking mother was, huh? Uh -oh. Move your ass! Move it! Oh. Hey, boys. You give this bitch ass pervert every reason to not creep around my daughter no more. Let's go move your fucking ass. Uh uh. Oh, this is gonna be fucking oh, fun. You wanna shit. creep my sister? Creep this bitch. Talk, talk with your father. Dang. Just talk to your father. What's this picture of? Shit. I don't want you to see that. Well, maybe I did. I don't know. Give it him. I like the car. Mm -hmm. I did too. Enough to buy him. It's mine. No fucking way. You bought a car? Didn't even get it home, though. Your mom and that prick ran off with it pretty much the minute I paid for it. Swear to God. Every few years, that godless cocksucker sends me a picture just to rub it in. So that's what mine looks like now? Yeah. That thigh's got fat. <laughs> You don't remember what she looked like, your mom? I was five. Biggest shame for a father. Not having something to leave his son. You left yourself that? <laughs> I don't know about that. Still, that fucking car should have been yours. Hey, thank you for, you know, not being a big pussy about all this. You got to be fucking kidding me. Fuck hey, us. hey, Wayne, don't go, don't bother. Wayne! <laughs> hey, Dad, stop talking noise here. Got some wrong mechanos and some M80s off those dipshits, too. Hey, Dad? Dad. Yeah. Oh, no. Damn, already.
You want to come to Florida with me? Why? Get my dad's cat back. What for? Because he wanted me to have it. Help! I need a bikini. Help! Look at the hell's up there. Just go up there and check then, you dick. Check, you fucking dick. Fucking don't, don't you fucking, fucking dare. <laughs> <laughs> Who's up there with you? I got a bat, bro. Wow. <laughs> Home alone too Wait, much? Wait, I have phones. Help! Answer me! <laughs> okay, let's go. Wait, let's go. Fuck this one. <laughs> Nunchucks. Who's not gonna do you any good? Who's ah! ain't gonna do you any good now, neither, you dumb son of a bitch? Uh. You! Wayne, don't hurt him. What did I tell you about seeing my fucking daughter? Huh? <laughs> oh. <laughs> He's done, bro. Get on the bike. I don't even care. Go. Fucking cock sucker. Oh, it's fair game now. Uh. Not like that. You're a fighter. <laughs> oh. 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 Del! Oh. Del, don't go, please! Bye, Daddy. Comedy. Whoo! This felt like something that would have came out in the '80s. This is a sleeper. Yeah, coming in. Coming and in, I woke up age. to it. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Coming of age story with action in there, comedy, and then the Deadpool writers did this too. Wow. Yeah. Why ain't make Deadpool this good? <laughs> <laughs> Amazon, baby. <laughs> this is like Dang. going down. Yeah. I'm impressed. Red Reese and uh, Paul Roenick, man. They, they some good writers. They know how to write characters. I give them that. I am impressed. Yeah. This is something, this is something new. Fresh. And it makes sense for this, something like this of this caliber to not be on television. This is a streaming factor. Man, why you didn't push this, man? Why you be like, Jay, we got to get on this, like Cobra Kai? Oh, yeah, I got I to gotta give you certain information. You know, I, cause, oh, you know you're very picky about what you watch. I, I, I am, but it this. It takes a lot to sell, Jake 3. It does. Oh, Every, everyone knows this. Man, but this sold me, man. Yeah. Just the. To... But look at how you found out, though. It was new to you. But I've mentioned it before. I know I have. Yeah, yeah, I know. Yeah. I, I had it downloaded. It was yeah. like, yo, we're going to get on it. We just never did. And, but it's like. I waited because I didn't want to push it because I knew we would eventually dang, get to it. Here we are. Hi, bro. You're welcome, by the way. Yeah. I'm intrigued. Like, well, I'm glad you found out the way you did because I know sometimes stuff gets overhyped, but this really lives up to that. This is a great show. Yeah. And you only saw one episode. What a sleeper. Yeah. It was a sleeper. Yeah. Oh, my. Oh, dude. I'm, I'm so. I, I, I want to get on episode two. Yeah. Wow. Well-written characters, sharp dialogue, uh, nice shots here and there. The characters are rich. 
music's on point. Like, it's a heroic kid who's living this kind of Clint Eastwood kind of lifestyle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, he's kind of have a broken family. You know what I'm saying? He's He meets his girl. He likes her. And then he's just basically on the quest to get his dad's car back and, you know, try to move on and start a new life because the one he has has kind of been destroyed. Yeah. They live a destructive life. And he's a good person who likes to help people. He's a fighter. And uh, he just, he likes to tell the truth. He, He doesn't like lying. So he has his own morals. He just has a funny way of showing it. You know, it's crazy because... Mark McKenna, great actor too. I'm already investing in Wayne. Yeah. Like, when his dad died, I felt it. Yeah. That's great writing. Yeah. That's great writing. For you to be able to just be like, damn, I don't even know his character yet. Damn, his dad his dad gone. All right. Tight, bro. I'm I'm with it, man. I'm so... I'm so... This is... This is... So much layers for a 30-minute episode. So much is going on. Yeah. You got the, the, uh, the dark humor, you got the brutality, you got the grittiness, you got the violence, you I got it all. I can't wait to finish this and all just the stuff talk about you like it. In shows. All the stuff I like, it's all in one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, there it is. It's like jam packed. It's like kick ass meets Scott Pilgrim, John Hughes. Yeah. Yeah, it's like Breakfast Club kind it, of stuff. It's all in one. Wonder Years <laughs> with a little kick ass. Yeah. yeah, she do look a little look like Wendy though, don't yeah. she? Yeah. Same same setup. You know, you meet the girl and then, you know, it's fighter, he gotta prove himself and then it's like odd couple. He bit his her dad nose off, bro. <laughs> and they met by exchanging Girl Scout cookie information, bro. <laughs> and she like it. she like left her family yeah. to be with somebody she known for a day. Right. Crazy. Well that's that's what Wayne will do, man. He just he grabs people's attention in like different ways, not the ordinary way. Even the, even the nurse had love and respect for him. I like I like his friend, the black kid. It, yeah. it, like kids be like that. Like yo, AG, he understood his position and where he stood in high school, and he was like, yo, that little Indian chick over there, bro. <laughs> she might be a little effed up right now, but she's actually cute. Yeah. And she ain't getting no play because right. she has the damn thing on her back and stuff. So everybody looking at her like she's some type of creature or freak, right. you know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know how high school is, and yeah. he's showing her the love. It's like he honestly went and got him a forever love right there. Yeah, pretty much. She's like, you the only one looked out for your girl, you know yep. what I'm saying? When everybody else turned her down. Yeah. That's, that's he's tight. like, hey, girl, you know, she got a little cyborg thing going on. We I, both winning tight. right now. That was tight. That was she was tight. cute. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like, besides, all, besides being locked up in prison, she was cute, man. You know what, <laughs> what I'm saying? <laughs> she had the bars blocking her, you know what I'm saying? I just I like it, man. The principal he I just told give everybody up. Young Justice exists. <laughs> I am heroes is out there, bro. Why 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 wasn't he Dick Grayson in the Titan show? <sighs> I know he fits the the description. I, yeah, he fits the description. Crazy. He's a dope actor. Mark McKenna's tight. The first time I saw him was in an ind- uh, independent movie called Sing Street. Mm-hmm. It was like a music drama. It was dope, and he stole the movie. He was the lead too. And that was that was my uh, discovery to him. And then I jumped into this like a while back, and I I, I seen him in like a little smaller like indie movies here and there, and he's he's a star in the making. Damn, he's dope, Mark McKenna, man. He's look out for him. Like this is it. Like I want you on the the Robin thing. Yeah. Like man. Yeah, he's tight. Like he might. Mm, you know what I mean? We got a campaign for him when like roles like that come up or something, bro. Like he's dope. Like. I'm campaigning for Wayne. Let me finish this show. Yeah. If this show hits like this next episode, mm, oh, it's just getting started. We, 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 we. You guys gonna get that that real? We gonna really push this, man? Cause Wayne need to come back. Yeah. If the, if it, cause they said they ended season one. And yeah. This needs season two. Yeah. Most definitely. Without a doubt, it definitely needs it. Uh, there's a lot more conversation, man. I I just feel like this kind of uh, scene, this subgenre. Needs a little bit more attention because these shows, like, they, they do well, they hit, and then it's kind of like just it fades away. And it's weird because you got you got all these streaming services and things like that. And sometimes word of mouth takes a little bit more of a challenge for shows like this because, again, you know, it's not superhero or anything like that. But it has elements of that, you know what I mean? And I think people need to get back to the shows that kind of made television and things like that because yeah. stuff like this is like a dime a dozen. They're this, rare. This is dope. God, I'm going to watch this when you leave, bro. I'm going to go back and watch it again, man. It's, uh, it's some originality out there that, that needs to be pushed, man. And uh, this is one of them. I like shows like this because I get to enjoy it. I mean, like, Grant, I enjoy a lot of uh, all my shows, but yeah. excuse me, it's more of like 
I don't want to think about what's next. Like, it's not that type right. of show. Right. You know what I mean? Where you like follow the adventure. Just, I'm just gonna go follow the adventure. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think like if it was to do like a, a, a like a Cobra Kai situation where they come back 20 years later, then you'd be like, oh okay. Got it. Got you. Let me put two and two together. But this yeah. is the beginning of something new. Yeah. Fresh. There's no. From what I know, there's no no information, no concrete, no no backstory, no history, nothing on this on this show. This is a brand new show. Yeah, no Wayne comic books, not yet. Yeah, not yet. <laughs> no right? video game, nothing. Else. It's just this is him. This is the introduction. I'm with it. Yeah, I'm sold. Shout out to you, brother. Ronald yeah. Joe Genji comes in with another one, That's another do, hitter, man. bro. Yeah, another hitter, sleeper, and man. I woke up on it. Dope, dope. And uh, you guys, you welcome too, man. Because there's probably somebody out there right now that probably hasn't seen it. I know you guys probably heard about it in the atmosphere, but there's people that probably haven't got a chance to watch it. But now you got the opportunity, too. So, you know. This was an A mother freaking episode. It's hell of a pilot. You never. Ugh. Yeah. It's like through everything. And I'm worried, a little worried about episode two because episode one was just so damn good. Yeah. Oh, but it, I guess you can do that when you don't have a show that doesn't have a history to follow. You're just going in and say, this is what I want to do. Yeah. I love think, that. Think of it like an episodic movie, pretty much. Cause you're just you're following Wayne, and you already like Wayne, so it's just, it's his journey now. And like, and what's he gonna do next? From the accents, yeah. the, the behavior, the prince. It's just it, it's the just characters are dope. It fits in. They're lifelike. They're believable. You can almost like you can almost like re- resemble somebody that you know, like in those characters, you know, things like that. Like they they exist. Yeah, even like, though it's like fantasy exaggerated, they're real people. He'd be like, yeah, I know, I know someone like that. I know someone that acts like that. So it's cool, man. It's like Wayne is like Sid from Toy Story, but but more effective. Yeah, Wayne's coming. Oh snap! Like he's like he has a he has a line like the bully bullies can beat him up like the big the jocks, but the kids that semi try to bully or you know what I mean? Like he gets hit a fool with a trumpet. Hey. It's funny though, because when you think about it, he has this uh, he has this aura when he shows up and people know him, and it's like, oh my God, it's Wayne. <laughs> Let me get about the way. <laughs> they either, yeah, they get out the way or they run. And it's the same thing, like kind of how like Matt Damon with uh, Jason Bourne, like, oh shit, it's Jason Bourne, he's here. You know what I'm saying? So it's just a funny situation how this kid has that kind of rep and that status, but you understand because he's always to himself. I'm with this man. Oh my he's God. He's respected and feared, even though he gets messed with. He still has his stats too. Yeah, he's like and I'm not there yet. Earns the like his dad, he's taking his exactly. same. His dad, his dad's uh, because he cares about people. Place. Yeah, yeah. He just has a different persona about it. Yeah, he's not an everyday person. Damn, his dad passed away, man. That it's was like, that was sad. In Wayne's mind, it's like if I can live to see another day and just get through it and survive, then I'm fine. I may not have like the best house or anything like that. Like Wayne is just like I need to survive. From here on out, so I do what I need to do and just and have to make the best of it. So he's just like a survivor. Yeah, he's a survivor first. Man, this was dope, man. Yeah, this is dope. And he'll go head up on anybody. Like he don't, he don't back down. I love it. So you're telling me, and I'm gonna end with this one. But YouTube Prime literally had two gems in the bottle. Yeah, two. And their seasons and their shows did not catch. It's insane. Who was doing your promotion? Because Cobra Kai, obviously, yeah, Cobra Kai is fire. Yeah. And a lot of people loved it. And Wayne also came out around Cobra Kai. Yep. You two need to get back on the ball game. Y'all had two fire shows. You came in swinging. I think, oh, man, because. They went too much on hype, man. They went on the shows to get. You know, and they saw, YouTube reality stars and stuff. You effed up with that. You they effed saw up the, with that. They saw the other competition too. It was like, we don't have a shot. But y'all did. Now Amazon finna take but Wayne. The promotion wasn't pushing it though. Yeah, I'm with it. These shows were what three years old now. Yeah. Where's the promotion at? And people were only jumping on the premium because of Cobra Kai and Wayne. So when the season ended, canceled, and then yeah, because I uh, bought I bought premium because yeah. of Cobra Kai, so, and then the whole deal with that, and then the other studios seeing the potential of those shows, picking them up, saying we can do something with that. 
So I was like, well, dang. So now YouTube's back at square one doing what they're doing. It was already kind of like a missed red flag because you already have content that's free. Why are we being charged? So it, it's like, all right, I'm paying for something great. Yeah, but granted, is it, is it going to be around forever? So now it's a different question coming into the conversation. It shouldn't have been that much. It should have been a dollar. Yeah. Because, again, people subscribe to what they like and what they want to see. Mm-hmm. Now I got to pay? It, that I can understand that rubbing people the wrong way. I, yeah, most definitely. It makes sense. Granted, the shows are great. I agree with you. They are. But it's like, man, it should have already been given. Because we're already like YouTube users. Or at least a, like an idea of a premium thing where... Or if, a month trial. If you, something. if you, they did a month, but I mean, like, I think I'll, I'll end with this one. Yeah. YouTube should have been like to watch it, you know, six months in advance, you become a member. Yeah, that makes sense. And then you watch Roll it. And that. then that way, you, at least you can hook them once they watch second season. Yeah. I mean, first season. Because then second season's coming and be like, oh man, I got to watch that. Then you're able right. to get more people to come in second time around. And then with the subscription, they got time to exactly. knock out the first season because it's pretty mm-hmm. short. Mm-hmm. You go through it in a couple hours. And then for you to do it where if you get the one you get the one week, you can knock out freaking Cobra Kai in in the day. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And, and it's obviously Wayne, too, because it's only nine episodes. So, you know, but this was a gem. And I love it. A episode. I'm down. Second season. Second episode. You're going to catch me and Ronan right back at it once oh, again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why Cobra Kai sits there and slumber to uh, season four. We're going to be reacting to a whole lot of epicness. and uh, It's going to be fun. Yeah, Wayne Wayne was on the list. It yeah. was on the list. Yeah, we so, talked about it for a minute. Mm-hmm. We did. We had that conversation. So, uh, y'all beware. Man, and shout out to the show for putting uh, putting me up on Game on some new soundtracks, like some indie rock groups and stuff. Oh, the music was dope in here. I Don't go. Whole, yeah. <laughs> I got a whole playlist on uh, on Spotify right now. And that, that main theme that you hear in the introduction... That's a band I call uh, Wolf Mother. They're fired. The name of the song is like Apple Tree. Apple Tree. I, I got all their albums. Really? They fire. Dun dun. Yeah, that's <laughs> Wayne's theme. <laughs> I'm 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 gonna look them up on Title Music. They they drive and drive and listen to them. Wolf Mother. Fire. I'm with it. I'm with it. Uh, if you're new to the channel, go ahead and push that subscribe button, thumbs this video up. Don't forget to share Instagram, Facebook, yes. and Twitter. All the above. If you like Wayne. Push that thumbs up button. Also in the comment comments, let me know what you like about this character, Wayne. And please, ladies and gentlemen, do not spoil the season for me. Because I'm going to be yeah, honest don't. with you. I'm not going to be in the comment section until I'm finished. But I do go back and read. So Say that one more time because uh, uh, I missed it. Oh, Please do not spoil Wayne for me. Put in the comments. Let me know what you think. I won't be in there right now, but I will come back when the season is done. When Stop we, when it. I'm done with the season. Stop it. Yeah. <laughs> but also, I would like to know any recommendations, guys. Let's build this hype. Let's build this thing. Yeah. Anything you guys want to see me and your boy Ronan react to. You got my boy Sable. You, oh, got, yeah. you got Chris. You got DQ. You got Knox. You know what I'm saying? The list goes on. So I would like to know what you guys want to see us do uh, in the comments down below. Um, that's a good way you can put those in the comments yeah until next time guys uh, peace love we out